for the girls' 1,600-meter run. And, Tom, before we talk seed times or expectations or anything like that, this is the first of the distance events that we're seeing in this NLL track meet. Let's talk strategy here. If you're running this race, what do you got to try to do? Well, you don't want to burn yourself out, that's for sure. You got to get a good pace. Good, good place to be is probably, like, around third or fourth, you know, and keep, just keep, like, uh, drafting somebody at the behind him. But you don't want to spend all your energy on, like, the, you know, first two laps. You want to just have a nice pace. You want to save it at the end so when you're coming around that curve, you got some left to bring it home. Well, the seat times when it would indicate a 1-2 finish for Sylvania Northview. Allison Work. Seat time of 5 minutes, 10 seconds. Not too far behind Abby Masters of 5.15. And off they go, 15 runners starting off this event. Sasha Lanning of Bowling Green on the inside with Courtney Clody of Perrysburg. Taylor Fitzpatrick and Allison Work, Southview and Northview. Crosstown rivals in the same lane, Alexis Sonnenberg and Karina Zielinski of Napoleon and Springfield. Section five and six. Jessica Suchak of A.W. Abri Dubler, 7 and 8. Madison Buck of Maumee and Erica Monian of Napoleon, 9 and 10. Then Taylor Monheim of Perrysburg. Abby Masters, and we talked about from Northview. Brittany Dara of Anthony Wayne. Mariah Zhalkowski of Springfield. And Sarah Board of Maumee round out the field. <coughs> See, when you come around that curve there, you can cut in. You have to stay in your lanes until this first lap here, and then they can start cutting in in the inside. Northfield girl there has a nice lead going on here. Got a nice stride. Like I say, you don't want to burn yourself out too much here, but you know, she looks like she's pretty strong right now, Mason. Well, so far the seed time's proving absolutely correct. Northview, Northview, Anthony Wayne, Perrysburg, the top four. She's actually widening that lead out right now. And that's pretty impressive. It is. <clears throat> She's strong. She's not very big either. She's a little tyke. <laughs> that's Allison Work way out in front. What are you thinking about if you're in the rest of this pack? At what point can you try and make a move on the top spot? Or can you? Well, <clears throat> I think when you come around this uh, back stretch here on the straightaway, you've got to start making some kind of move because you'll never catch her. So. Of course, then you might spend yourself out, you know, you know what I mean? But you got to start making a move soon here. Well, Allison Work, a pack all to herself on the inside, way out in front of the rest of the field, looking at the possibility of a Northview, Northview finish between, uh, with Work and Abby Masters, the top two. Then we've got two from Perrysburg. And then Anthony Wayne currently in fifth. Well, she keeps this lead up for a second and third. Could be interesting here. They're really bunched up. They're right together. I don't think anybody's going to catch the girl from Northview right now. Well, at the moment, that is looking highly <laughs> unlikely. <laughs> highly unlikely. She's way out there, buddy. And she's getting stronger, I think, as it goes on here in the race. I wasn't a distance runner, I was a sprinter, so I looked, I'm getting tired looking at her. <laughs> <laughs> you, you never tried the distance events? Oh, no. No. 400 is the farthest I got. <clears throat> now, maybe if you ran four, four, one hundred, uh, four, four hundreds right. over the course of a day, you exactly. might reach. You might reach that. You might get to might the 1600. Yes. Yeah, I think barring something unforeseen, we can chalk this up to a Northview win. But then and you, you look at the rest of the pack. Got Perrysburg and Perrysburg currently in second and third place. And running stride for stride, but they're all chasing Allison Work of Sylvania Northview. There's the gun lap. This is it. So I think we're going to have a good race here for uh, second and third. I'll tell you, this is a grueler. She's putting on the sprint. Look at her. Northfield girl, she's getting stronger. That is impressive. 
She's going for a big time here, I think. She could just coast and why in. why not? Yeah, why not? She's strong, boy. She's, she's putting it on here. There's Courtney Clody and Taylor Montenheim of Perrysburg. Second and third, and now they're starting to break away from the rest of the pack. Boy, they're running neck, neck and neck, too. That's cross country running at its best right there. You got it. Down the back stretch comes Allison Work. Job nearly done, very close to a fantastic time. She's going to get a big win for Northview. The question by how much? Then Northview takes the 1600, Perrysburg second, Perrysburg third. Wow. There's some points arena there for Perrysburg, second and third. Well, what a great race by the Northview girl. Well, she was really strong. She put it on that last lap. She started sprinting right around that first curve and she didn't let up. What a, what a great race by her. That's a really impressive performance. And now here comes everybody else. Everybody else sprinting down the stretch, too. Selfie and Napoleon neck and neck. They're going to pass Bowling Green right at the horn. But a great race run by Allison Work of Northview takes first Perrysburg, second and third from the NLL Championships. Tassel